Hannah Clark and her three children will be laid to rest today after the family was murdered last month. Brendan Smith joins us now. Brendan, no doubt an emotional day for the Clark family. Yeah, it will be indeed, Annalise. Aaliyah, Leana, Trey and Hannah will be laid to rest here today at City Point Church in Carindale in Brisbane after they were brutally murdered last month by Hannah's estranged husband and the children's father outside Hannah's uh, family's home in Camp Hill. She was on the uh, school run that morning when that man attacked and doused their car in petrol. It really tore apart the Camp Hill community. Hundreds of bouquets of flowers, well wishes and teddy bears were laid at the scene early on and it really did tear apart that community. And then we did hear more about exactly what happened uh, to Hannah and, and in her marriage. She was a domestic violence victim and she had in fact left that man uh, months prior to her being murdered by him. Now we heard from Hayley Foster earlier this morning who said more needs to be done around domestic violence. And the federal government is throwing only around $100 million across the nation at this problem. That's, you know, if you break that across the, uh, you know, up across the jurisdictions, that's around $10 million per jurisdiction for one of the biggest problems facing uh, Australian women and children. Um, so we, we would challenge um, the very notion that we're throwing enough resources at this problem. So Annalise, hundreds of well wishes here today, family and friends, and including the Prime Minister Scott Morrison will be attending here today to bid farewell to Hannah Clark and her three children. Brendan, thank you.